Hello, welcome to the channel. Today we're going to go over mobilizer delete on EDC 15, for example, Volkswagen ALH diesel. We're going to be using a blue KKL cable for this. Uh, so first thing you're going to do, connect your cable of course, open up the bag tester here, come down to the bottom, change this to K-line, engine control unit, read EEPROM, Wait for it to connect. Then we're going to save to file. And I'm just going to save it on the desktop as EEPROM test.bin. Save. Then leave this open. And we're going to open up this. EDC 15 calculator software. Click OK to that. Again on the desktop, open up our test file. Open. You see our MO status is on. I'm going to click off. Calculate the checksum. Save. And I like to rename it so I know which is which and I have a backup. So click Save. Close. And come back to the <clears throat> bag tester software, load from file, and uh, off file. That's there. Then we're going to write EEPROM. EEPROM is written, and we're done. After that, you can power off and disconnect everything, and that is it. And actually, something else you can do after you're done writing the EEPROM you'll want to cycle the key again and then reconnect everything and you can come back in here just like we did before <clears throat> do all the same steps all right well it didn't work so Cycle the key again. And we'll read again. See if it'll connect. There we go. And you can click save the file. I'm just going to save it as check because I just want to open it again and check to make sure. Save. And go back to our mobilizer calculator program. We're going to load that file. Check. Open. And there you go. You can see mobilizer status is indeed off. So then you just verify that it is off and you're good to go. You can exit out of all this and put the ECU back in the car or in the car if you've got one and you're doing a swap and that'll be it thanks for watching hope this is informative and helps some people out uh, if you liked it leave me a like if you want to see some more please subscribe and uh, we'll catch you on the next one